All right, what up everybody? Super excited because tonight is the night we're going to one of, if not my favorite restaurant I've ever been to, Alinea in Chicago. The cuisine, if I would define it, is a molecular, sort of experimental, scientific. I've never had another restaurant like it. That's what you're eating before. Going with Kai, my dad. So many different websites have claimed that it's the best restaurant in the world. It has three Michelin stars. I've been twice before, once for my birthday and first time when I was super young. But I haven't been in maybe like six or seven years, so there's definitely some new stuff and I'm excited to show you guys. You're ruining your palate before. This is actually sent to us by Alinea. When you open it, it's a beer filled ham. <laughs> I, you know, it's funny, you know, uh, even though I'm kind of old school chef, but I'm, I've always wanted to learn. And I think uh, tonight is going to be a really great experience. I want to uh, open my mind to try different things. Grant, I think he's one of the greatest chefs in the world. He's very inventive. Um, he always wanted to breaking boundaries. Yeah. It's quite secretive. There's no, what's it called, sign. I wanted to make a little speech. <laughs> hey, I hope this uh, turns. A little cloud of brioche. It's so weird, it's like a cloud, but it tastes like brioche. <laughs> we like to refer to that as a trampoline. Just for fun, we're gonna bounce this sphere here on our trampoline. While this, this we're our own chef, garnishing our own dishes. So Kai and I like to do this little test when we go to these super nice fancy restaurants. Set a little timer and see how long it takes for them to fold the napkin that's on the chair. So we're going to do that test. So they told us they're keeping this a mystery for a bit. Oh, it's hot actually. Chat GPT. What about it? Well, apparently it's like like the most uh, like artificial intelligence, right? Yeah, How yeah. are you? I'm good, thanks. Good to see you again. Then. Yeah. You want me to do the example? Yeah. You slowly, it's like a little barbecue skewer. You slowly remove. Ah, uh, and then. Yep, exactly. One shot. Mm. The potato that we dropped in was like piping hot, but the broth was very cold. So when you take it as a shot, it's like this weird combo of something really hot in your mouth and cold at the same time. We're gonna ask uh, for you to get a bit hands-on with this presentation. Cobia collar. Placing that sleeve right under the pin of the collar and holding it up and using the fork to essentially flake the meat off the collar. I did. Wow. <laughs> Thank so you. What is this sauce again? Uh, pine nut and mango. My colleagues, Chef Steven and Chef Russell, are finishing your dish here. It's uh, inspired by the Midwestern version of your classic apple pie. So on the grills above that Japanese charcoal, you have some Granny Smith apple. It's been compressed in caramel. It's gonna join the contents of the bowl already in front of you. Smoked pecan cream, a bit of brown butter, roasted pecan, and a little uh, dehydrated onion in there as well. Uh, Chef Russell and Chef Steven are gonna finish that off with a hefty amount of this melting raclette cheese coming from the Ozarks in Missouri. Once you have all of the ingredients in your bowl, you just want to use the spoon. The non-alcoholic version of the cartoon. A bit of uh... <laughs> so So we came back to the table now from the kitchen and it's transformed into this different style setting. Lighting's different in here and completely changed. A uh, nice centerpiece here, uh, potpourri, actually some hidden elements in here. Uh, uh, pear compote, uh, foie gras mousse, and then some biscuits for those to go on. If I could hand those off to you. Yeah, yeah thank there you. There should be enough fun to view in plain sight this entire time. There's a couple of little bites. They are hiding within. Oh, sorry, I'm gonna have you lift off this little white cone here. Take it off the stand. Perfectly done. 
nicely done. A little bit of spice here, some savory notes, one or two little bites. This is the signature dish. We're at the final course now, the big presentation. Smoke coming out from the wall. Oh, I thought it was, uh, I thought it was Kai vaporing. <laughs> no, seriously. <laughs> Pull it down with a string, kiss the top of the balloon, inhale as much as you will prefer. Come on, Dad, this is so amazing. I'm so glad we came here today. <laughs> uh, oh my gosh, I sucked it so much. <laughs> Uh, yeah, this is <laughs> <laughs> such a great meal here at Alinea. So we just wrapped up on the way home now. How was it? It's really a, a nice dinner. You know, we had some new. Yeah, I think it was very good. What do you think of the food? Good. Great experience. Um, Favorite thing? This is the whole experience service. In the room now, we have an early flight tomorrow morning, so we had to get up to bed ASAP. But dinner was amazing. Big thank you to the whole team at Alinea. Took great care of us. Chef Grant, who actually did our dessert at the end. A crazy dessert at our table. We are actually going to Milwaukee. Well, it's random as hell. I don't know if I can speak on it too much, but maybe I'll show you a bit, but it's mostly just for business and then we're in and out of there. On the way to the airport, the weirdest thing happened, I, was, I get poker TikToks and it was a TikTok of Phil Ivey playing poker and I randomly just saw him in the Chicago airport. Are you getting McDonald's? Disappointed? What disappointment? He's a big man. You know what Always. a big man means? It means no longer, you know, decision is made by his experience being a big man. Want me to turn this into gourmet? Oh, this is the first time I've ever seen you just eat McDonald's. Mmm, the sausage. Awesome. From Alinea to McDonald's, the next day. The bowl are opposites. And we're already on the way back. It's not even 12 hours here. But excited to go back home. We were initially supposed to stay till tomorrow morning, but we ended up getting a flight on the same night. Oh, finally home, didn't vlog the travel process because it's just long, three flights in one day. Happy to be home, very happy to be home. Just gonna go to bed, edit this video tomorrow morning. Later. Officially back home, have some more exciting content planned for you guys. Dinner was amazing. A little more of a recap of our dinner since I feel like I was a bit rushed since we had an early flight the next day, we were tired. The meal was amazing. The reason why it's one of my favorite restaurants is such a different experience than any other restaurant you'll really go to in terms of inventiveness, uh, creativity, applications of technique to food like the liquid nitrogen all this crazy stuff so yeah it's just an amazing experience thank you once again to the Alinea team hope you guys enjoyed the video i'm on another flight but this one is a super fun one because i'm celebrating my four-year anniversary with sid i had to do this that milwaukee trip sort of during our end time our anniversary time so we planned it for the week after and we are going to miami so I'll see you there, have a bunch of restaurants planned. I have so much stuff in the works that I can't talk about, but I'm gonna try to get back to posting on my regular schedule, or at least once a week since I know I've been a bit all over the place.